So I've studied uh, international business in Maastricht, in the University of Maastricht. And after my master's, I started working in the corporate field for several years. I felt a bit, after a certain moment, still uncomfortable and didn't feel completely right for me working in the corporate field. So that's when I slowly started to be involved more uh, in the arts, uh, uh, doing more sculpturing. I see my work as an artist in the socio-economic domain, meaning that I also uh, want to quit contribute with my art to stimulate thinking and reflecting about our behavior. At the academy, I was very interested in, uh, in, in working with nature as a media and uh, also the economic came back, always this economic interest, interest in business. The, the project that I developed here was called uh, uh, Smoothie Takeover and was uh, the concept of the project was to sell share uh, to sell smoothies banana smoothies and slowly taking over the company uh, of del monte that it's uh, very dominant in selling bananas so i built uh, this selling booth in uh, a few days and um, um, at, during the open studios i started to sell uh, the smoothies i priced the banana smoothies four dollars and uh, calculated the cost that I had per smoothie, so that was around 64 cents. In that way, I could also calculate, of course, my profit. And during the, the open uh, studios, during that day, and on my stand, there was a screen that was showing the, the stock price of Del Monte. Depending on the stock price, it's about 64 and 65 billion smoothies and that would take me around 25,000 years full-time selling smoothies so that's a long time so I can heal and need I, I can use some help next to the selling stand there was um, uh, somebody sewing the uh, banana peels on uh, final canvas uh, the idea behind that is that it's a kind of a marketing instrument that's co coming from from very yellow to slowly turning into black. I think in my art it's, uh, it's very much about those bigger structures that are surrounding us and that influence our day-to-day -day, uh, practice in a way. Um, but through my art I can make people uh, reflect on this 